Good evening. The state television company Western Armenia represents the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. Residents of Sabaisa demand restoration of ancient cave dwellings. Renovation works at St. Kyriakos Armenian Church in Tigranagar. 7,000-year-old Balash fortress and other historic buildings illuminated by night lights. In 2020, the number of tourists visiting Port Asar will increase. Yerevan among 20 hot travel destinations for 2020 suitcase magazine. The 4,600-year-old cave dwellings in the village of Todulke, Sebastia, Western Armenia, may be restored at the request of local residents. About 100 caves in the north and southwest of the village of the Todulke were built about 4,000 years ago. The caves have small rooms which were probably used during the Roman period. In the caves to the north of the village, there are signs of the cross suggesting that the early Christians live also here. It is known that the Armenians were the last to live in these caves. Residents of the village want the caves to be better constructed and these caves to be open to tourists. Reconstruction of the St. Kyriakos Armenian Church in Tigranagert began a month ago. The renovation is expected to be completed by the end of 2020. Earlier in 2011, after being abandoned for a long time, the church was renovated and reported with funding from the Church Foundation and the municipality of Tigranagert. But during 2015-2016 clashes ensued, the church was in the state of disrepair. There were large holes in the walls of the building and the roof was damaged. The St. Kyriakos Church of Tigranagert considered as the largest Armenian church in the Middle East, was built in 3076. It is located in the central district of the Armenian populated Fatih Pasha district. Bagash Fortress, which is about 6,000 years old, was illuminated by night lights thanks to the efforts of the Ministry of Culture and Tourism, the Bagash Governorate and the Municipality. The historic castle that has reached to our times captivates viewers with its magnificent illumination. The National Geographic, the world's most renowned organization in geography and discovery, has included Port Asar in its book entitled Places to Visit Before Dying. National Geographic, which has millions of readers and followers, has also included Port Asar, historic site of Western Armenia, as the best place to visit in 2020. They described it as a mysterious place and as the area dating back to prehistoric times, which is 12,000 years old and is the oldest known temple in the world. It is older than Stone Age and the pyramids of Egypt. Egypt. Armenia's capital Yerevan is among the 20 hot travel destinations for 2020, according to a suitcase magazine. In Yerevan, traditional taverns crowded with locals compete with European style wine bars, Soviet era buildings show their modern structures. According to publication, Armenia's capital is a city of contrast and a hive of activity. Set your setting point as a dancing fountain in Republic Square. It is the best introduction to the city. Suitcase magazine advises. Now let us represent to your attention a song by Masong. of the song in the official page of Western Armenia TV. This was all for today. Goodbye.